Mm, nope. There is a new firmware update for the P1S, and there's a new firmware update that's not that new for the X1C, supposedly. And yes, I do have three AMS units, now that you ask. Um, that's for a different project that I'm kind of doing. So yeah, supposedly there is a firmware update that makes this thing quieter. So we'll see about that. I'm gonna mount the sound meter here, just so it's consistent between runs. I don't know, I guess I'll print maybe a XYZ cube and we'll compare it before and after. So it's really important before I actually update this firmware that I, that I get that data point because I don't have it at the moment. So this is my cube I'm working on, uh, a new kind of calibration cube. You'll see more of that later. Okay, I'm gonna update the firmware. There's also a total print time counter on, on this version as well, apparently. I looked at the release notes and something about being able to access the SD card remotely, but we'll, we'll, we'll see about that. No going back now. Let's hope I got this right the first time. Because yeah, at the moment you can't undo updates, or at least that's that's what people are saying. They do recommend a full calibration after you've updated firmware, so 26 minutes. I'll I'll just do that. Okay, moment of truth. Let's um, let's print the exact same file. And these two cubes look pretty much identical. There's slightly more stringing on the after one, but also maybe if you look on that side there, it's maybe neater here on this corner where it has to do a thin corner. There's, I mean, maybe it's just, sort of natural differences that I'm not really seeing anything huge that would be a problem. Apparently the new firmware does help with VFAs but it's very hard to replicate VFAs on a bamboo machine anyway so so there you have it. I think it's um, it's definitely a difference to the first layer noise because the machine doesn't move that fast on the first layer so I think if you're in silent mode 
you will notice a huge difference in the in the noise before and after the firmware but in normal mode um, the machine is kind of just loud and it will continue to be loud and okay maybe it's five percent quieter I don't have the exact numbers I'll, I'll work them out maybe put them on a on screen but yeah it's still a noisy machine at the end of the day because it's moving so fast so the main benefits are going to be when you're running in silent mode I think so there you go I'll do the same with the x1c at some point but I expect the results will be identical we'll we'll see